Iraq's President Baram Saleh on Saturday assigned Muham Tafiq Alawi with forming a new government, according to the state run television. Alawi, who is a former communications minister, was named prime minister designate by rival Iraqi factions on Saturday after weeks of political deadlock. AFP cited three Iraqi officials as saying, Alawi, 66, would run the country until early elections can be held. He must form a new government within a month. He was born in Baghdad and served as communications minister first in 2006 and again between 2010 to 2012. He resigned from his post after a dispute with former Prime Minister Nouri al Maliki. In a pre recorded statement posted online, Alawi called on protesters to continue with their uprising against corruption and said he would quit if the blocs insist on imposing names of ministers. If it wasn't for your sacrifices and courage, there wouldn't have been any change in the country, he said, addressing anti government protesters. I have faith in you and ask you to continue with the protests. Last Wednesday, Saleh threatened to unilaterally name a successor to the country's premier, who resigned in December, if parliament did not nominate a candidate within three days. If the concerned blocs are unable to resolve the nomination issue by no later than Saturday, February 1, I see an obligation to exercise my constitutional powers by tasking whomever I find most acceptable to Parliament and the people, Baram Saleh wrote in a letter seen by AFP. Prime Minister Adil Abdel Mahdi resigned in December after two months of deadly protests against his government, but he has stayed on in a caretaker role, as deeply divided political parties have failed to agree on a replacement. According to Iraq's constitution, parliament's largest bloc must nominate a prime minister within 15 days of legislative elections.